Hi, have you wondered how to make the current time display in the game like this one or maybe that one? I will show you that in this tutorial. If you would like make the timer like this, don't forget to subscribe for the more tutorials and videos. So let's begin. So if you wanna make the timer with the text, I have shown it with the last video. So go check the link below and this is how it's look. Um, this time I'm gonna work with the text mesh pro so how to make that you go for the ui and like you say i don't have it so you need to go to the windows packet manager and here you need to write the text to find the text mesh pro and it's possible that you will get like this in the project and you won't see it mm -hmm. remember to check and go for the unity registry and then write text and here is the text mesh pro and just install that it will take a moment so i just skip that okay so let's install it so now you need to go to the ui and text mesh pro and i just leave the basic name text text mesh pro because we're gonna know what we're going to do and if you go to the scene i have as well one tutorial when i explain how to set up the position and scale and everything on the text and it's gonna work exactly the same and there is a width height and whatever you want you can set up that let's make like this and i will just make make it ball and set it on the middle here you can change the color but i will not worry about that in this video because i just want to show you how to make the timer check the other one so you will see how to set up that however you want so now we need to create the script and let's call it text mesh pro current time and you can add that script to the text or you can just create new empty object reset position and you can call it text mesh pro current time and add the script to it and we go to the script you can remove here all that and just leave the update and what you need to do it's using system and using text mesh pro otherwise you won't be able to use the text mesh pro and the system it will be needed for the getting the date and time so let's make serialized field you can make it as well the public but serialized field is safer for you so you don't get access for that from the other script if and we need text mesh pro text and let's call that current time and now we need to add that to the update current time text equal date time now to string and this is the first option i will show you three of them and this one will show the date and time let's save that back to the unity and now we just need to add our text mesh pro to the script so just move that here and let's see and now you see we have the date and time exactly what we have in your current time zone so another way if you don't want to show the date just time you can just copy that so instead go to the string you need to use to long time string in this way you will see only current time and you won't see the date And now when we start it, we 
have only the time. And there is one more way you can use that. If you want to just date, you need to use too long date string. Let's back and now I will see just the current date. So now everything depends whatever you wanna set up. You wanna set up the date or you wanna set up the time or maybe you wanna both. This is the other way you can use that. Hope I help you. Hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and share. If you're interested, check other videos from my channel. See you next time. Cheers.